M mode echocardiogram is one of the oldest modes of echocardiogram. There was also a B mode at the time. M mode stands for time motion mode. It was also called TM mode. Time motion because this is actually a single dimensional imaging. You can see this two dimensional image here and from the two dimensional image a cursor is placed here. This is the cursor placed in two dimensional image and it is like an ice pick view of the heart along the single dimension and the horizontal axis in this uh, picture this will be a moving picture when you do it live uh, the horizontal axis is time vertical axis is uh, distance from the transducer suppose the transducer is here this is uh, parasternal long axis view in two dimensional echo this will be the anterior chest wall free wall of the right ventricle portion of the right ventricular cavity mostly in the right ventricular outflow region and this is interventricular septum you can see that anterior and posterior parts of the interventricular septum has been marked here that's for this left ventricular measurements nowadays in modern echocardiography laboratories M mode is used almost exclusively for left ventricular measurements and this is the posterior left ventricular wall anterior part and posterior part this is the septum again this is in diastole you can see the diameter is more in diastole and this is in systole so this downward movement of the septum and upward movement of the posterior wall in systole are due to contraction of the left ventricle this is the mitral wall echocardiogram. This particular echo, M mode echocardiogram is from a case of mitral stenosis. You can see the calcification of the tip of the posterior mitral leaflet here and doming of the anterior mitral leaflet. We can also call it as a hockeystick appearance. And you can see that the left atrium is grossly dilated. Usually, this is the aorta. Aortic diameter and left atrial diameter are almost similar. This is grossly dilated because of mitral stenosis and you can see that uh, the posterior leaflet instead of opening in diastole has moved upwards that is paradoxical anterior motion of uh, posterior mitral leaflet. This is cross section of descending aorta and uh, a portion of the coronary sinus is probably seen here. In M mode this is the flattening of EF slope, thickening of both leaflets.